Hi guys, in this tutorial, I will be teaching you how you can make text for your edits. Dad hasn't been home in a few days. At first, I will start with beginner friendly stuff. Then we will be doing some basic text settings. First, create a composition. Here are my composition settings that you can use if you'd like. I'll be using standard box settings, 1080 by 1080. Open the characters tab on the right side. Adjust the settings like I do and follow carefully. Click on the T icon on the top bar. Click on the preview to create a text layer. Then you can type what the character is saying. After that, click on the effects tab and search for fade. Drag and drop fade up words onto the text layer. Click on the text layer and press U on your keyboard to see the keyframes. These are created by dropping the effect onto the layer, just so you know. Adjust the keyframes to match the character's voice line. This will fade up each word. The first keyframe should be set at the start, two or three frames before the character starts talking, and the last keyframe should be five or six frames after they stop to create a smooth illusion. Now drop the fade out slow effect onto the text layer. This will be used to fade out the text when it is fully displayed, or in our case, to start fading out smoothly before the text is fully shown. This is recommended if you like my text style and want the exact same effect. Otherwise, feel free to experiment with different settings. For the fade out keyframes, move the first one 10 frames before the last fade up keyframe and move the last fade out slow keyframe one second after the last fade up keyframe. If you're new and this seems overwhelming, just follow my steps closely and listen to what I'm saying. If you've done everything correctly, this should be the result for the text. To add a bit of life to your text, we'll add some movement. Search for increase tracking in the effects tab, then drag and drop the effect onto the text layer. Move the last keyframe to the end of the layer. Right click on the last keyframe of increase tracking, select edit value and change the value to 5 to 10 for 1080p settings. Alternatively, set it to 10 to 20 if you're using 4K. This should be the result for the text. Now we will add a glow effect to the text layer. Search for deep glow in the effects tab and drag and drop the effect onto the text layer. Adjust the deep glow parameters as I do. This should be the result for the text. Search for Drop Shadow in the Effects tab and drop the effect onto the text layer. Adjust the Drop Shadow parameters as I do. Select Drop Shadow in the Effects Control panel and press Ctrl plus D to duplicate it. It's up to you if you want to use one or two drop shadows. I personally prefer using two. All right, that's all for this tutorial. I'll have a link to the text pack in the pinned comment. If you have any ideas for future tutorials, let me know in the comments and I'll create a tutorial on those. By the way, there will be another short tutorial focused on text effects. This is just the first of many. Thanks for watching and staying until the end, and I hope to see you in another tutorial soon.